If you are new to our channel, please subscribe and hit the bell icon for receiving latest updates on exams, research positions and guidance videos. So let's start the video. Hey guys, welcome to Inspire Chemistry. So today in this particular video, I will discuss one very important thing that is how to write research write-up. Okay, for uh, research internship, research project or PhD. Okay, so actually for research, ap for application of research internship or research project or PhD, there are some important uh, things are needed. Actually, those are statement of purpose, research write-up, letter of recommendation, this type of important portion, uh, CV, this type of important documents you have to need. Okay, so first one is research write-up, though that portion I have discussed I will discuss in this video and uh, statement of purpose we already discussed this uh, thing in our previous videos you can check in our YouTube channel otherwise video link will be in description box you can check okay how to write statement of purpose so actually research write-up is a very basic thing you all know this thing actually this is the summarize or gist portion of your research interest so why what is your research interest why are you choosing this topic few important brief idea uh, related to this your research interest this type of portion you have to write in this research write-up so in this video i will discuss this research write-up related things and i i, I have listed four to five points uh, on this research write-up so you have to follow these four to five points that will be sufficient for you a good research write-up okay so there there are uh, word limit i think around 150 to 250 words for writing this research write-up so you have to follow these four five points and you have to write shortly under this uh, 250 words okay so first important portion is write about your specific research area you have to mention the specific research area or research of uh, interest of your research area okay first portion second point is few words or few uh, things you have to discuss about the research area suppose your research area is organic synthesis okay otherwise metal organic framework then you have to write what is metal organic framework uh, some important portions related like what type of metal organic framework are there, what is exactly this is and uh, what is the application, its structure, the uh, some important magical use or other things you have to discuss. If your research interest is organic synthesis, then you have to mention what is organic synthesis, some catalysis, some uh, procedure of organic synthesis, substrate, reagent, some examples you can give, okay, but in short way. If your research interest is physics related like quantum related, nanomaterials related, then you have to mention what is uh, quantum related, that, that topic, what is nanomaterials, type of nanomaterials, what are the use, uh, uh, the particular uh, application area of nanomaterials, you have to mention these things, okay, in short way. So first point is you have to mention your research interest or research area. Second, you have to discuss in a short way that what exactly this area is and your its application in very short, okay. The third point is why are you choosing this area actually why are you interested in this topic okay so suppose you are interested in organic synthesis so you have to mention that I am uh, very much interested in, in this topic as um, I want to do some uh, important synthesis related to medicinal chemistry or some drug synthesis other things you can mention according to your interest why are you choosing okay you have to write in your words okay this is the third point fourth point is, fourth point is uh, what you want to achieve through this project okay or internship so you have to mention that you are doing this project you are writing this write up for some reason right for internship or for a research project or for phd so you have to mention what is your goal through this project or through this internship so you you have to write this uh, according to your own words actually you have to write that if your uh, area is a lithium and battery okay so you have to write i want to achieve the i i want to make some cathode materials which which will have uh, good higher energy density high voltage higher capacity this type of things if you may if your interest is organic synthesis synthesis then you have to tell that uh, through this project i want to achieve that uh, good uh, uh, important drugs alzheimer related drugs or uh, or you, if you are interested in nanomaterial then you have to mention the particular important advanced research areas or advanced research uh, achievements related to this project okay so these are the important portions so and fifth one is very uh, common that no copy paste from internet if you you are uh, copying 
some important points or few words from the from the internet or some books then if they can detect this one that you are copying from other uh, places then there will be bad impression then you can you, you will not be selected okay so actually you have to write your research write up or research statement of purpose in your words okay so the main five points are first you have to mention your research area some few words or some discuss that uh, why uh, what is this particular area some application in short way okay and some different types of these uh, materials or other organic synthesis methods if your area is in the in this otherwise you can uh, discuss in your words third point is why are you choosing this inter interest area okay so you have to mention some important points fourth one is uh, what do you want to achieve through this project uh, you have to mention some advanced achievement so for this you have to read some advanced uh, research papers or review papers or articles uh, in your according to your research interest okay and fifth one is no copy paste you you uh, if you co do copy from other places or internet then through the software that will be detected that you are copying from uh, which source then bad impression will be there and you will not be selected so these are the important portion so when you are writing some research write-up follow these five points that's all so research write-up is very you have to write in summarize and in short way under 250 or 200 words according to the guidelines of the internship or research project so these are the important few points for writing effective a write-up uh, so that's all so follow these important points and write your write-up so that's all so if you get any information from this video please hit the like button and please share this video with your friends that can help your friends also and give some important information and updates also so thank you for watching see you in the next video